I am Dr. Kundulose. I am a vascular surgeon working here in St. Blasius Hospital in Dendermonde, a small city in Belgium. I'm working as a vascular surgeon and 90% of my work is in fact endovascular surgery. As a vascular surgeon we are not only working in a clinical world, but here in St. Blasius Dendermonde we are also involved in a lot of educational work, research and development work. Based on our research work, we are involved in a lot of national and international congresses. We are performing every year almost 1,500 endovascular procedures, mainly peripheral endovascular procedures, going from head to toe, carotid interventions, aortic procedures, iliac, femoral, popliteal, and especially also below the knee cases. For me as a vascular surgeon and mainly in this endovascular field, there are two important uh, keynotes. It's safety and efficiency. And so it's very important that imaging systems like our discovery is uh, helping me with uh, realizing these two topics. Another perfect example to increase this uh, efficiency is the use, the introduction of the vessel assists. So I can really track a center line as a preparation of the uh, operation and then I fuse the central line on the live surgery. So for me it's more easy in this way to recanalize for instance a long occlusion. I just follow the fused line on the screen with my guide wire. It avoids perforations, it avoids false tracking without adding more contrast and more radiation to my patient. Another perfect example of this innovation is the way the 2D, 3D fusion is working nowadays. Nowadays I notice that we can do the 2D registration intraoperatively just with two images. So what makes it much more easy, much more intuitive and much more accessible to realize it during the surgery. So for me it's a, a real honor to have these uh, uh, first applications of the uh, vessel assist here in Dendermonde. It's really honoring our daily endovascular work uh, to make it more safe and more efficient for our patients.